the things that we're featuring this year at the Miami Boat Show is our new Navnet 3D system. Navnet 3D is a uh, GPS chart plotter, but it's a lot more. It uh, provides some new technology that the industry hasn't seen before. We can take you through a couple of the uh, unique features of 3D. One of the first things you'll see, the redraw time. It takes a long time to have the chart redraw on the screen. Navnet 3D provides a technology called Time Zero that provides instantaneous redraw, so the chart never leaves the screen. Uh, you can also see as we scroll around the screen, you have the ability to quickly explore the chart and you can simply get back to your vessel position by hitting our ship button. Navnet 3D also comes preloaded with all of the NOAA raster and vector charts. Everything's preloaded for the U.S. coastline. And it is very simple on the fly to change between raster and vector. This is a raster chart we're looking at right now. And I can simply go into my chart menu and change from raster to vector on the fly. And if you see the instantaneous redraw. A lot of people like the raster charts because they are essentially scanned images of paper charts that most people are familiar with if they've been navigating before. Now we also offer some other data layers, if you will. Uh, one of the layers that we're going to take a look at is the ability to do satellite photos. We have a very nice high resolution satellite photo that we can bring into the picture here. And there's a unique function to the satellite photo that we use. A lot of companies do this, but we do it a little differently. It's a patented technology that's called satellite photo fusion. Sounds kind of fancy, but it's a very easy thing to explain. What we do is we take the depth information that's programmed into these charts, and we use that to show how we depict the picture on the screen. So what you'll see on land is you see a very high resolution photo image here because we don't need the chart data on land. But you'll see in the shallow areas where there's nice structure that's provided by that photo, we provide you with the structure and we merge it or fuse it with the chart so you see the best of both informations that you're looking for. Another feature that we like to, to highlight is the ability to show depth shading on the screen. This is a very good feature for uh, a relatively inexperienced navigator if they want to be comfortable with their depth scenario so they're not worried about going aground or being in a shallow area. And it's very easy to access this. One of the things you've seen me using is our roto key interface and this is a very simple interface. We feel the roto key is a nicer, easier interface because you have one location to go to on your system every time to access the dynamic set of soft keys that are on the screen. So, in order to get to overlays, I just simply dial to overlay and I choose depth shading all from one location, which is the roto key. You see the depth shading come on the screen and what that provides is once I put in the draft of my vessel, I can easily see, pictured in color, the shallow areas that are shown in yellows and reds and the deeper areas that are shown in greens and blues, which would be safer to navigate in. So rather than having to look for individual depth spot soundings, as we call them, or contour lines, which maybe requires a little bit more paying attention to the chart, this is a very simple thing to look at quickly and say, hey, this is a dangerous area and this is a safe area. So it's another nice overlay feature we have. One of the other layers that's very important is if somebody wants to add radar to their system, simply dial my roto key to the radar function, turn it on, and now you see that we have high resolution, all digital, high definition radar now layered or overlaid with the uh, chart screen, which is a very nice feature. Now everything we've looked at so far has been in a traditional, what we call top down or two dimensional mode that everybody's used to on a chart plotter. The beauty of Navnet 3D and why we call it 3D is because everything you've seen is also available to be shown in a 3D environment. This is the only system available right now that allows you to go in 3D and still see an official nautical chart, not just a graphical rendering of an area. A lot of people ask also, you know, it looks very cool, but does it actually help me navigate better and more safely? And I say absolutely yes, I'll show you a quick example why. I went back into a traditional top-down mode, you'll see we're only at about 300 yards here. And if you look, we have a very good detailed close-in picture of what's going on. But what we don't know is what's ahead of us. What's in, uh, and in the traditional past chart plotters, in order to see that, we'd have to zoom out and look forward. But then I lose my close-in detail. If you notice, the ability that I have with 3D is now, as I go into that tight, very good close-in picture, I go into 3D by simply hitting my 3D button. And now what you'll notice is I still maintain that very good close-in imagery around my vessel, but I also at the same time have a very good look at what's coming up up forward, so it's kind of the best of both worlds and it's a very good benefit of navigating in 3D. You also have the ability uh, to change the various screens that you're working with. We've been working with a single chart plotter screen, but if you notice, we have the ability to custom build screens and if I want to do a, a fishing picture, for instance, where I want to look at my chart and my fish finder at the same time, we have that ability. So here's my chart with radar overlay. 
so I see exactly where my uh, navigational scenario is, and at the same time, I have a very nice shot of my fish finder. We have uh, di all digital fish finders with all new digital filtering. So that's uh, some of the uh, highlights of the Navnet 3D system. It's important to note that uh, Furuno, in addition to the 3D, has really a full complement of navigational and communication marine electronics. We provide anything from radars, fish finders, communications, VHF, and also autopilots. So we really do a full complement of products from really anything going on a small trailer boat all the way up to a super tanker. One of the important things about that is because we're so well entrenched in the commercial market with a worldwide service network, our recreational customers also get the benefit of accessing that service network. Because you're not only buying a product, you're also buying into a company. And it's important to know that company provides service anywhere that you may go with your vessel. So as we've been going through the system, we've been showing you our black box version of Navnet 3D. The black box provides a separate keyboard and a processor and then allows you to interface any monitor you want, any size. As you can see, we can even put it on a plasma screen. However, our Navnet system is also available for any type of boat size. You'll see that we have two other displays that we offer, which is an MFD-8, this is an 8-inch display, and also the MFD-12, this is a 12-inch display. All of the functionality that you saw at the black box system is available in either the 8-inch or 12-inch display. If you'll notice, the keyboard also is identical, so it's just along the side here. And we also have the ability to make a network, Navnet being navigation network, you can have multiple stations around the boat and mix and match any of these displays depending upon what your needs are, possibly a pilot house and a flybridge type scenario, as well as remotes in uh, various areas around the boat. So there's a lot of flexibility in, in operating with Navnet 3D.